Here we go. Coming off turn number four. Lights are out. We're going green. Foot to the floor for coming down the front straightaway. Great race in action. Bombley with a rocket start that time off of turn number four. Leroy Morrison with a good run as he will settle into that second spot. How about Josh Munson up to that third spot? And here comes Steve Starmer in that 11S making his way to the front. Starmer all the way up to that fourth spot. What a run by Steve Starmer so far tonight in that 11S car. Battle now for that second position out on the racetrack. We got the 50 on the high side, 19 on the low side, and here comes Starmer going even higher than both these guys down the front straightaway. Starmer will hang on to that fifth spot. Starmer thinking of threading the needle as we got a new second-place car. Josh Munson will settle into that number two spot. Good run by Starmer tonight as he and Morrison going to be battling side by side for third. Munson a little bit of a problem that time as Starmer way up the racetrack. That's going to open the door as Nick Haynes and both the 50 of Leroy Morrison will go back by the 11 of Steve Starmer. Here comes the 9H of Haynes. He is going to look on the inside. Morrison will hang on to that fourth, third spot. Nick Haynes will do the slider down in turn number one and two. He will take over that spot. Starmer now coming back. He is going to look on the inside of Haynes. Green flag back out on the speedway as they come off turn to turn them one. Little contact between Starmer and Nick Haynes as Haynes got a little slide ways. Here comes Austin Charles. He is coming through the pack in a hurry as he will pass two cars at one time as we come down the front straightaway. Good move by Austin Charles as he is now cracked into that top eight. Leroy Morrison holding his own that 50 car. Good run for him here tonight. Austin Charles sets his sights on him up front. We got a battle for that second spot as you got the 19 of Josh Munson. He will be doing battle with the 9H of Nick Haynes. But up front, J.J. Bombley having everything his way as that 46 is working here tonight. Bombley on the high side. Munson a little bit lower. And here comes Haynes even lower down through turn number three and four. Steve Starmer now settles into that fourth spot. As we go down the back straightaway, 46 of Bombley again out front by about four car lengths as we head into turn number three. Off of turn number four, looks like Haynes is going to take that car to the high line, see if he can't pick up some more speed. As Starmer, the man on the move, starting to close in in that fourth spot. That time Haynes clips the infield. That's going to cause him to lose a position as Starmer gets by him in that 11S car. Starmer, now your third-place car, but here comes Haynes back on the inside. Good racing all over the speedway in this IMCA Sport Mod class. Again, Bombley out front. 19 of Munson runs in that second position. 11S of Starmer in that third spot, and here comes Haynes. Haynes going to look on the inside of Starmer, unable to get it done. And Starmer will hang on to that spot. Good run for the 81 of Austin Charles. He is always up to that fifth spot. Good run by him. As he has got it working here tonight. Austin Charles with a solid top five run here tonight. Chris Wright making his way to the front. Coleman Browning runs behind him in that seventh spot as Nick Haynes put it move on Starmer, unable to make it work. And Starmer hangs on the third. And we got a battle for the lead, race fans. Ramon Ortega taking that car into the infield. Surprise for the 17R. His night is done. The battle on the racetrack for first and second, third and fourth. Here comes Munson looking on the inside of Bombley. Bombley will hang on that lead with a white flag in the air one more time around. Bombley's going to lead them down the back straightaway. Here we go, race fans. Things are heating up for that third and fourth spot also as Haynes is on the high side. Starmer on the inside. Starmer's going to slide that track up. J.J. Bombley picks up the feature win. Second place, 19X of Josh Munson. Third place, the 11S of Steve Starmer. Then come the 9H of Nick Haynes. 81 of Austin Charles. Rounds out your top five. Let's see. I think I've got the young gun next. Connor Mayster, you drove this car hard tonight. You had to come to the back of the pack to get to the front. But you got it. Put your 47X in victory lane. Top job here tonight. Yeah, it feels good to finally get in here. I've led a lot of laughs the last couple of weeks, and it feels good to finally win. I tell you what, the fans get a treat because they're going to get to. Let's move down here where we can hear it better. We're getting a little bit out of range here. 
We'll stop right here. I tell you what, uh, last week it looked like, well, two weeks ago at Bethany, it looked like you had a car to beat too. The car just kind of went away on you. You've really been fast here. You're getting faster and modified. And everybody gets the treat of that wristband, gets him free tomorrow night at Bethany, gets to see you do it again. Great race. How about your sponsors? Uh, they're great. Uh, Polar Motorsports, Prime Racing, uh, Lake Road Warehouse, Firehouse Designs, Jet Racing. Got to thank them a lot for making a, a, building a good car, Cameron Engines. Um, I really know anymore. Uh, Scott Brothers Racing. Uh, yeah, brilliant graphics. Yeah. All right, again, great job tonight. Thank you for being here with us, and good run. Congratulations. Thank you. Race fans, another big round of applause. The young gun himself, it is Connor Meissner.
Shane Bailey kept working that highlight of perfection. You were talking to me before the race, and let me quote you on your words. I've got to get five times faster to do any good in this car. Well, I think you may have found the magic touch. Tweaked it just right. The seven, Shane Bailey, from Victory Lane. Yeah, we, we've been working all day. First come out, it was, it was bad. The track really helped me tonight. Moistured up. The crates are so fast, like slick, you know. But we just kept banging the top up there, just kept working and working. And I knew I was a little bit better than he was off the two. And I just tried not messing up and getting in the fence. And then it kind of went away. And I yeah. seen Chatter down there on the bottom. I was like, man, I got I to gotta slow him down just a little bit. It's got to be about over with. We hung on to it. It's, uh, it's good. It's, it's all right. We'll take it. You've got to feel good to run like that, especially against a caliber of talent that runs here. You've got the board and raise the shed and turn two in a row. You broke that streak tonight. That's got to feel good to be in victory lane. Thank us through the sponsors that help make it possible. Yeah, I got to thank uh, uh, Team Timberline, Mike Dotson, and uh, Isaac. Uh, they give me the. Hang on. Let's get her working. There we go. They, uh, they helped me out. Yeah, they get me to the track. If it wasn't for them, I wouldn't. Let's get her going. I wouldn't uh, I wouldn't be doing what I'm doing. So I got to thank them. Uh, I got uh, Scott Crystal of Crystal Trenching out of uh, Oldwood Park. He's, he helps me out a little bit. And uh, that's really about it. Genius Graphics, they do the graphics on it. Uh, it's kind of simple deal. So we just, uh, we just come out here and try to have fun. The race fans, let's give him another big round of applause. He drove the wheels off of tonight. Nice job, Shane Bailey. In Victory Lane, I am CA Modified.
on in Victor Lane. I tell you one thing. You put on a show tonight, coming through the pack like that. You told me before the race, you said, I don't like having to come through the pack. Well, I'm going to tell you what, you had about 900 to 1,000 fans, but like you did like seeing you come through the pack. Nice job behind the wheel of this 41. Yeah, they like it. I don't. Come on over here a little. Well, they like it. I sure don't. <laughs> I tell you what, I do as an announcer. It gets me all worked up to see you race that way. Thank you for the great sponsor to make it possible. I gotta thank Reckless Designs, you know, he does my rap, Native Skins, uh, Lopez Mexico, JW Boys Barbecue. Uh, Matthew and Maggie come help me every week. They're great help. Um, I gotta thank Gerald and Hillary, they let me use their shop, my parents, my wife for sure. I think that's about it. Congratulations on a great win, three in a row, and we expect four. Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Congratulations on a great job. Let's give him another big round of applause. The rowdy one, Chris Deshaun, Evon, future winner. Now, did I get everybody? I think I got everybody. Smile, Sean. Shane Bailey, smile down there, Princess. Don't be so don't be so glum down there. I'll give you a push. Great race in action here. Remember that wristband is good. Tomorrow night up at Bethany for general admission. So come on up to Bethany Speedway. Tomorrow night, more great race and action IMCA style. We will see everybody next Friday night right here at US 36 Raceway. I tell you what, great race and action, great fans. We want to apologize for running a little bit late on the start tonight, guys. We've done the very best we could with the weather conditions. Can't deny great racing on the track. See everybody next week. Be here.